I'm not a cocaine guy anymore. <laughs> I've gone through phases of drugs in my life, but I don't do drugs anymore. I smoke weed, but no drugs. <laughs> Just weed, you know? I mean, I would do like mushrooms or acid if somebody had that, but that's not drugs. That's just tripping. It's different. But no pills, no powders. That's my thing. I mean, like, I'll take a pill and crush it into a powder. <laughs> Put a little drop of water on there, make a paste. I ain't say nothing about paste. <laughs> nah, just weed. I've been through phases though. I did, I, I tried meth when I was 15, actually. I, in 1997, I'm from Independence, Missouri, and in 1997, Independence, Missouri was the methamphetamine capital of the world, which we were all pretty proud of. Uh, <laughs> But it was me and my friend Frazier, and we started smoking weed together in like junior high. And then when we got into high school, there was this dude named Donovan that lived up the street, and he was an older guy, and he would like sell us weed and other stuff sometimes. And, and Donovan was cool as hell, and we were super lucky that he let us hang out with him, is what we thought at the time. Like, looking back now, it's like, we're 14, and Donovan's like 33. Why does he want to hang out with us? But. Then he gave us meth one time, and it was awesome. We both played football. It made me better at football. I could, like, read people's thoughts and shit. Was, like, meth is like a lot of drugs like that. Like, it's, it's good for you if you only do it for, like, six months. It's after that when it starts fucking your life up, you know? But that first six months, like, you eat less, you lose weight. Like, you're more social. You make friends and shit. Your whole house gets cleaned up. <laughs> You're better at high school football. Like, everything about it is great. It's after that, though. That's when you start sucking dicks and stuff. And I don't... <laughs> I didn't make it that far. I probably would have, but my parents found out, and then they wouldn't let me do meth no more. I was pretty upset at the time, but looking back now, it was probably for the best. But, but yeah, so I'm sober now, mostly. California sober, I believe, is what they call it. But now there's like 30 other states that you can say, I guess I'm Arizona sober now, too. So that's pretty cool. All right. That's the end of that part. There's no segues with my comedy. One thing ends, and then we wait a second, and on to the next thing. I'm scared of robots. We're gonna have robots soon, just walking around, talking to people and shit. We already have some robots, but they're not like shaped like people yet, so they don't freak us out, you know? But they exist. Like the automatic flusher thing on the toilet. It's a fucking robot. Just staring at your dick. <laughs> and we're fine with it. I don't know. Imagine if it was like a robot guy that was like, I'll flush when you're done. <laughs> And I'd be like, no. Watch me pee, robot. 